All right, hi everyone. So today I'll show you how to autocraft Iron Amber, and we are going to be using processing cable here from Single Storage Network and a packager. So normally you would you need five iron resin and four iron apron to craft one iron amber. We're going to be requesting that from the system here. Iron amber. I'll request this item, so you have to put in five and four iron acorns. So I'm gonna do it again here, show you. So I give five resin and four iron acorn and one iron amber here on the output. Okay, so I think this is the direction, and it doesn't really matter, it actually works even without setting it properly. The first thing I did here is to make sure it's uh, it requires redstone here, so that way we can turn it off and on. So right now it's off. Now it does require a power here, so we have the generator. Okay, let's try it out. So first thing you have to do is, uh, if you turn this on, it will not work. All right, it's on already. So before it gives these things here, it requires the output first. So you have to put in the output here, just the iron ember, and it will uh, start to automate. Look at that. Go. Pause it for a minute here. As you can see, it gives us 5 resin and 5 acorn. Try it again here. Right now it's off again. I'm gonna give one iron amber and gives us uh, five resin and four acorn. So really easy to set up. Start it off, just give it one amber. It's all set. And we can just turn it on. Alright, check that out. See how fast it is. Okay. Oops, already here. Quite fast indeed. So that's how you can autocraft your iron amber. So she automatically goes back to our uh, simple storage network here. I think it's processing cable, so you don't need to do like the uh, importing and extraction here. So you don't have to do that.